us feel better if we had gotten into that ethics hearing yesterday. How can they say that non-hospital staff can't come in? We had real evidence. Only what Skyler told us. Against his own best interest. He'd be toast right now. If he's cleared, it's gonna make it a lot harder to make my case for custody. It was weird sitting in that hearing like like a potted plant while, while Taya just lied for me. Did she outright lie? Well, she didn't let me tell the truth that I didn't actually give the oxytocin to Stacy. Well, you couldn't say that without admitting that you took the drug in the first place. If Rex and Gigi had testified, you would have went there. Yeah, and instead I just I squeaked by on evasive maneuvers. Sky, do you know that you screwed up? Yeah, royally. Are you trying to make it right? Best I can. Do you want custody of your daughter? <laughs> yeah, yes, that's why I sat there and I took it. I mean, I want to raise my daughter and I can't do that from jail, so... You might not have to come to that. Okay, if the ethics panel knew that I, I stole the drugs, they would automatically assume that I gave it to Stacy. They can charge me for that. And the only person who knows that I didn't is Kim. And, and who knows if she'd clear me. <gasps> Look at you! Uh-uh. You're no longer working that out. I missed you! And now you're getting married? Oh, my God. Oh, I'm so glad you guys came. Like... Yeah, usually I say no to the private jet <laughs> ride. <laughs> Are you really getting married mm -hmm. today? Uh, you okay, Nigel? Um... Guys, meet my butler. This is Nigel. I am the Buchanan butler. Okay, we need some Bloody Marys and some brunch. Oh, and something vegan for Laudine. Oh, <laughs> over it. Oh, okay. Size of bacon for everybody. <laughs> Will I have time before I'm required to make a sculpture? Hmm? I understand from this young woman. Leah. Yes, I'm sure. She tells me there's to be a wedding. Uh-huh, that's right. And when will the happy nuptials be? Today. Clint didn't tell you? No. Brunch. Uh-oh. Oh, no, no, don't worry. It's happening. But you're sure? Because if he liked it, then he should have put a ring on it. Mm-hmm. Well, let me get this straight. So you asked Kelly to marry you right after her mother died. That's funny. I'm surprised she turned you down. Todd, would you just stay the hell out of this? Such a sad little buddy, aren't you? I mean, the woman cheated on you with your son, you still want her. Jesus can't man up, can you? God, how big a loser do you have to be to work? Yeah. Yeah. God, stop it! It was sweet that Kevin proposed, but I couldn't. Too much has happened. <sighs> what? Oh, well, I'm just surprised. You know, you slept with his son, Duke. You gave his grandson son. And you guys still stay together? I mean, what's bigger than that? Maybe the fact that you slept with Kevin. Oh, you know what? No, 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 no. You can't blame me for your problems with Kevin. You don't want to marry the guy, that's fine. But do not put that off on me. Hey, I just dropped by to offer my condolences. I heard about your sister. Thank you. So what happened? Hmm? Apparently, she had a heart attack. Only trouble is, she had absolutely no history of heart trouble. So you think, you think that Mitch did it? He could have. He's still threatening my girls. Okay, so what are you gonna do? I'm not gonna let him control me anymore. This has to end. I had no idea you and Charlie were having trouble. It's the end result of a lot of things that have happened. It's not about the shooting, right? Because you know that Charlie was aiming at Mitch. So. Oh, I know that. And no, it, it's not just that. What? After Jared died, Charlie shut me out of his life. Completely. He did not trust me to help him. He went out, he got a gun. He was going to murder someone. He put everything ahead of our marriage. Eli's on his way. He filed for temporary custody, so we can't take Sierra home. What did they say? He's hopeful. Skyler looks bad for all the right reasons. 
He tried to duck out being the father. He's in trouble with the hospital. But he's still the dad, so any order we get today will be temporary. There will still be a full-blown hearing. Look. It's like she's waving. It's so good to see her moving around. Isn't she gorgeous? She looks a little like you. You think? The mouth, especially. You mean big? <laughs> yeah, she'll grow into it. Thanks for being here, Rex. It means more to me than you'll ever know. That's where I want to be. With you.